Hey guys, um, today I'm doing a video on my World Heavyweight Championship title belt. You can see, it's customized, nameplate, so let's get to the basics. This belt was about exactly $320. As you can see, I don't really know what this is. It's bronze or brass. And, um, Let's get to the other part. You can see right here, about 22 in all diamonds. They're all fake because this is the, um, just the classic version. This isn't the ultimate deluxe. Got the diamonds here. Two little rubies here and there. You can't see them though, that easily. There's two medallions. The center medallion. Um, I'm pretty sure all of this here is real leather. But the only part about this belt that I just really don't like about it is this here. I can't, I can't even tell really, but this is this is fake leather. And the snaps, as you can see, one side is actually bigger than the other. And um, the back is not what you think it is, like you see on the show. All black, big leather backing. The official WWE shop. Then the official licensed product. And of course, the sticker that changes the logo from ECW, SmackDown, Raw, W Legends, and all that. And yet, it's all screwed in. Here, I, I can take these off if I want to. The main plate right here. The the rest of it is just mostly the centerpiece and the medallions here. Except for the two in the center here, this is the main plate. So I could take these off, but I'm not going to do that. I've already lost several of the screws, but I mean, luckily I found them. And the pieces. I wouldn't look as good as it is now if I didn't find the one. Well, and let's get to the other part of this. It comes with a WWE cloth bag. Um, this comes free. It's not like you think a full unzipper. The unzipper is halfway. And you just put it in like that. But into the top and the bottom piece and slide the two sides in. So I'm not to. Um, you want to buy yourself one of these? I bought it on um, WrestlingSuperStore.com or WWE, no WWEShop.com. This delivers in about like forget how much business days, but I don't know. But if you're gonna get one of these, for starters, I since I, since I'm not even an adult yet, I'm only 14. I fit on w one less strap now. I had to button it all the way, so now it's secured. It can be buttoned with four snaps on me, so I grew a little more. But yeah, this is, this is a very nice product. I recommend buying this. But the only thing I blow about it is the leather here. Other than that, it's just perfect. And I would recommend you buy this. Really nice replica, sort of thing. You can get it re-leathered. Well, I think the site you can get it re-leathered at. If you order it on the site called AJSBelts.com, you can actually, uh, I think you would just ship it into them. And uh, you can get it re leathered from them. Uh, I don't know if they do the red leather backing like you see on TV. But uh, I think they just re modify it all. And they're charging you like $200, I think. At max. So I really don't remember because I haven't been on that site in so long. But it doesn't offer much selection. And there's just one site for the WWE Championship title belt. It's about $1,000. It's a full scale replica. 
all leather, probably all gold and the diamonds and everything else on it. But I forget the site where it's on. And it's a thousand dollars. I think it's like an ultra deluxe. But yeah, for for beginners, I recommend this. And as you can see, I got my name plate on it. On the WWE shop, they, there are two different models of the replica for the nameplate, which will charge you like I really don't know how much, but they'll charge you a little bit more for nameplate and customization. And then you can just buy with that with the nameplate with blank. So um, that's it.